morning. It is Wednesday. Today I am working from home because there's another snowstorm that's coming in. It's actually been snowing for a while now. It's not going to be as bad as last time, but this one is called Storm Irma. Time for lunch. When I went to the Costco with Enya and Micah, I bought this huge pack of taquitos. There was 30 of them. And I was like, you know, it's not going to taste that good. It's just taquitos and it's frozen. Um, I started eating it and then ate eight in one sitting because they're not horrible. They're not the best, but they're not horrible. Um, but yeah. I think after this, I'm going to go for a fruit smoothie. And then we're going to eat more fruit. Do people put oranges in their fruit smoothies? There's this one guy that I work with. I don't have any major issues with him, but we're just on two very different tempos. I'm like, boom, 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 boom. And he's just like, boom, boom, boom. And so it's just really funny whenever I have to interact with him and I'm trying to grasp the tempo, but it just doesn't work. The snow has dwindled down a lot, which is great. I don't know if I should still go check out my car. Maybe I will. But for right now, I really want to take a nap, and I still need to finish editing today's video. There's a lot of editing going on. I just woke up from my hour-long nap, and I feel like I need to go back to bed. I'm eating these bark things. This is the dark chocolate pumpkin seed with sea salt. It is so good. It's actually quite expensive though. It's one of those like premium snacks. So I don't buy it at Target and those stores. I bought this huge bag from Costco, which I thought, I was like, okay. What I really want is, you know those ramen snacks, the crunchy ramen snacks? I kind of want that, but I don't have any, so. Ugh. Christine Mooney is back from California, and we're going to start our Let's Cook Together again. Something with chickpeas. So we have Tabasco braised chicken. That sounds pretty good, though. Chickpea avocado feta also sounds really good. Oh my god, guess what? I have my package from Sephora. I didn't get too much because honestly, like I've mentioned so many times before, I don't have that urge because I have so much stuff already. But I did have to get a couple of things. I really wanted to try this and I got this as part of like the Beauty Insider Points. This is the Blender Cleanser Ch Solid Chill Swirl. My brush cleanser is almost used up, so I wanted to see if this works. I just had to figure out how to store this. The first Ole Henriksen thing. This is the Transforming Walnut Scrub, a two-in-one lightly foaming scrub that exfoliates, cleanses, and purifies pores with a cocktail of natural wonders, including walnut powder, ginseng, and chamomile extracts. It goes beyond exfoliation for a deep cleansing, pore purifying action that diminishes dullness. Skin's surface feels transformed. Instantly leaves complexion fresh, pure, and invigorated with a use la la. Instantly leaves complexion fresh, pure, and invigorated with a youthful looking Ole Glow. Urban Decay, the drop shot mix in facial oil. This is a lightweight fluid foundation booster. Create your own luxurious skin softening complexion cocktail. Add a shot of this mix in oil to foundation for conditioned skin and a dewy radiant glow. Our lightweight nourishing oil blend helps makeup apply smoothly and blend easily, leaving skin soft, not greasy. The winter is a little dry, so sometimes at the end of the day, my foundation kind of turns flaky, and I want to see if this helps with that. And then I just have a bunch of, like, the free samples. Are you ready? So I have a sample from... dinner and I think I'm gonna try this out. This is the Singapore Laksa Lamian, which is basically premium noodle and aromatic coconut soup. I don't know how I'm going to feel about this. We will see how it goes. So normally when I cook dinner, I usually have to prepare lunch for the next day as well. So that's what I'm looking at right now. I know it's like more common to 
put either chicken or seafood with your laksa. But I have spicy Korean pork, so I'm going to do that. For lunch tomorrow, I am going to also eat noodles. This is, I, I, believe, I believe this is soba noodles. I'm doing it while watching a beauty YouTuber. This one is Alyssa Ashley, and she's talking about the new Tarte Shape Tape Foundation. Hi Lily, you're being introduced to the video today. Oh, this is the cup that wakes up. So when there's no it's dead. Oh, <laughs> Today's mask, I am trying this one from Enya Tianmu Beauty Innovation Moisture Mask. Circulating and hydrating formula instantly nourishes and moisturizes skin. A lot of these Asian masks from Taiwan, especially. They put the mask itself in between two layers to retain as much moisture as possible. So you take the hard part off, and then you put it on. Mm -hmm. And then you turn the blue. And match the mouth. And then pull upwards. Match the eyes and then pull outwards. You got it? Don't forget to cover your nose. Okay. Access on me, and there is still some serum in here, so I'm gonna rub it on my chest. My name is Juliet. Juliet. With, With a, a nugget, nugget of chua!